how much did we make on the first letter? So, I'm gonna come right out and say it, and then I'll explain it. So, on the first letter, we made. I'm authentic. Who are you? What up, people? It's Authentic Benny, and I'm back with another video, man. And today, today, we gonna be talking about Authentic Frenchies, man. Y'all see the shirt? Um, we, you know, I always get the questions asked. Um, is it profitable to start breeding? Um, a lot of people ask, how much money do I make breeding French Bulldogs? A lot of people actually ask how much I made on my next letter. I don't know why people so nosy, but you get so many DMs asking how much the puppies cost. You know what I'm saying? People who have no intent on even purchasing a puppy, they asking how much are the puppies. They want to know how much the dogs are um, just to see what you making. You know what I'm saying? I respect somebody who just come out and ask me, you know, what I'm making rather than, oh, uh, I know somebody who want a puppy, you know, blase, blase. Man, come on, man. Just just, just ask what you want to ask. You know what I'm saying? That's just what it is. But um, this video is going to be on that specific topic because I've been getting so many questions just like that. So um, we're going to get right into it, man. First and foremost, y'all make sure y'all follow the Instagram. Um, three different Instagrams, man. Make sure you follow all three. Um, Authentic Benny is the personal page. Authentic Dot Frenchies is the dog page. Make sure you follow that to stay up to date with any any new little the people who's really serious about getting a puppy. You know you can hit me up on the um, Authentic Dot Frenchies. That is Authentic Dot Frenchies on Instagram, and also the car page is mostly car content. You know, I put a little family stuff on every now and then, a little personal stuff. And I also put a little dog stuff on a store every now and then. But it's mostly car based and that's authenticated. So make sure y'all follow all three Instagrams and make sure you stay up to date. But without further ado, man, we're gonna go ahead and um, roll on into the topic at hand. So the number one question I get is, how much you make? How much do I make breeding French Bulldogs? So I'm gonna run you through the prices of uh, French Bulldogs first. So typically a French Bulldog can go from uh, 3,000 to 10 or 20,000 dollars. You know, it, they range, the range is so wide and the prices of french bulldogs so when most people ask me how much the french bulldog cost i ask them well what specifically are you looking for because it, it, it got a lot to go into it genetics um um coat color it's so much that can go into the price of a puppy now this last letter that i had it was mostly standard blacks and i had two um I had two that were actually a reverse brundle, you know, like a real, real nice reverse brundle, just like Tigger. 
And then the girl, she was like, I never saw a coat like her before because she was the reverse bundle, but it was like ghosted. She was real, real pretty. And um, that's our girl, Nina. Her name is Nina now in New York City. But uh, most of my litter was standard black, standard black, you know? So um, they are usually like standard colors are usually on the lower end of how much you're gonna make as far as profit. But we were blessed, bro. Like we were really, really blessed on our first litter, knocked it out the park. Um, that's why I'm, 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 I'm going even harder for the next letters, you know, for the, for the next group of people who want to be a part of the uh, authentic Frenchie family. So um, we're going to definitely liven things up and take it to the next level. As you've seen, we added Stormy to the camp, you know, got her from True Line over there in Florida, uh, vlogged the whole thing. Y'all can see us going to Florida, pick up and everything. She is a blue Merle. Her specific genetics will take this program to the next level so if you didn't get in like on the first letter the i'm sorry to tell you but the prices got the, the prices gotta go up you know i'm paying you know upfront costs so i mean obviously you know i gotta make the money back on the back end so she's a rare she's a more rare color that's just a whole different caliber of people that i'm reaching with that rare color you know so um make sure y'all stay tuned for that um should be end of next year or beginning of 2023 for stormy so i'm trying to wait the first two heats skip them and then on the third heat boom we going in with stormy um she's like real real small she's like real real tiny She's short, as y'all seen. If y'all follow the Instagram, authenticated on Instagram, she will produce some heat, man. She will produce some heat. And um, I'm real excited for that. Um, but getting back to the subject on hand, man. How much did we make on the first litter? So, I'ma come right out and say it, and then I'll explain it. So, on the first litter, we made, I wish I had a pen. I write this down, man. <laughs> we made zero dollars and zero cents on the first letter. Now, you might be asking why would you keep putting money out there and spending money and doing all this and doing all that if you're making nothing? Well, I gotta get I gotta get into the reason while we made zero dollars and zero cents on the first letter. So first and foremost, everything that was made um, selling the first letter of Authentic Frenchies, all that money was reinvested into, into the business. You know, a lot of people just get that money and get the buying thing, cause it's quick money. Don't get me wrong, it's a lot of hard work, but it's some quick, quick cash, bro. A lot of people would get that cash and spend that cash on stuff they never had before or stuff they wanted in the long, uh, you know, for a long time. That's not me. That's not my mindset. That's not what I do. So what we did was we took all of that money, reinvested it back into the business. You know, you see Stormy. Um, we also got a few um, studs coming up actually for our next letter. And um either the end of june or august next letter coming up so we got a stud out of california that all costs money you know we got another stud lined up for a little that's next year boom locked it in that all costs money so you got all this money going out all this money going out but you this is this, these are the things you have to do if you want a successful business you know, you can't just hold on to money. You got to reinvest. And that's with everything. It, it don't even have to be a business. It could be money that you make at work. You know, you, you can't just um, keep your money in the bank and expect to get rich one day. You gotta, you gotta invest that money, man. Take chances, make that money, make money. That's the only way you will be successful. 
you know. Um, I read somewhere, a penny saved is still a damn penny. That's a very, very, very simple statement, but it holds so much weight, man. A penny saved is still a damn penny. You gotta take your money and make your money work for you, man. I'm telling you. So um, when you ask the questions, how much you selling these dogs for? How much you making? How much this? How much that? If you're not willing to do the things that I do, which is take zero away from your hard work and hopes that this reinvestment could bring in more, then this ain't for you. I'm telling you right now, it, it ain't for you, man. Cause a lot of people wouldn't do the things that I do, make the crazy choices and uh, leaps of faith that I make. But the people who choose to make the leaps of faith is usually the people who end up winning. You know, I've learned that. I'm telling you, man. I, I'm tell. I promise. I promise. So, um, that kills all the questions, all the comments. You know, you don't have to come in my DM no more, asking, "Oh, your best friend, baby mama, uh, want a Frenchie? How much you selling for?" You don't have to do that no more. Now you know how much I took away from the first lift. Zero dollars. Zero dollars because I reinvested. Zero dollars because I believe in something bigger. Zero dollars because I believe in um, pushing a brand to another level. You know, pushing an authentic Frenchie brand to another level, man. Um, I believe um, we offer something here that it's rare. Like, I'm going to keep it real with y'all. Like, Anybody can get two French Bulldogs, do a little research, have some puppies. But it takes a certain type of person to actually care for these dogs, to actually um, make sure they're healthy, to actually make sure the puppies are healthy, to actually make sure they eat good. You know, it, 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 takes, it takes a certain type of care. And here are authentic Frenchies, we, we got that. We got that down pack, man. Shout out to Mo, man. She been doing her thing like she was a big part, a huge part of this whole business, you know. So um, she took care of the puppies more than anybody in the house. You know, everybody work here, the kids and all. You know, we all part of authentic friendships. So um, she she really did her thing with this litter, and uh, y'all gonna see more come from that. So we gonna keep it pushing. We gonna keep it grinding. And uh, on the next litter, we we expecting some. You know what? I ain't gonna even I ain't gonna even tell y'all what we expecting on the on the next litter. Just know it's gonna be some fire. It's gonna be some heat. It's gonna be so much pressure. So much pressure, man. Um, we laid up and we did our research for over three years before we even had puppies. You know, a lot of people just be down for the quick dollar. No, no, it's a lot of research, effort, um, and grinding that goes behind this. It's not easy at all, but we will succeed. I promise you that. So um, that's what it is, man. So um, a lot of people asking all these questions about um, what a Frenchie costs and um, how much we made. A lot of people ask these questions because they pretty much, they nosy. I know what it is, but it is what it is. Um, so I decided to put this video out to pretty much um, kind of indirectly inform you on how to make proper life decisions, you know? Because uh, I know a lot of y'all click this video just to, again, find, you know, people love to count people pockets, which I don't get that. I never got that. I don't even want to get it. But... People love to count people's pockets. And um, that's just the nature of human beings. I'm starting to realize that. But um, like I said, man, um, I wanna indirectly inform you on how to move business-wise, on um, how to uh, maintain uh, uh, proper business ethics. You know, so it, it take a lot of people, it take a certain type of person to do that as well, to be trustworthy, to um, <clears throat> know how to talk to people, to
to know, know how to carry yourself, to know how to make a customer feel like they they good. You know what I'm saying? It, it takes a certain type of people to do that. Like anybody who bought a friendship from us, man, we got you for life. Like any questions, any comments, ask anybody who ever bought a dog from us. Hit us up on text. We're going to get right back with you. You going out of town? Drop your puppy off here. We're going to take care of your puppy. Go handle your business. Do what you got to do. Like, we we back you for life. That's what we do over here at Authentic Frenchies. So, um, I appreciate y'all for rocking with us. Everybody who bought um, one of our Frenchies on the first letter, I appreciate your support. It's only a start, man. Um, we're going to take this thing all the way. And we got new breeds coming. We got new breeds coming too, man. Two other breeds that we got in the pocket. So y'all make sure y'all stay tuned for that. Follow the Instagram, Authentic.Frenchies, man. Um, follow all the Instagrams. Follow the Facebook, Authentic Frenchies on Facebook. Man, we lit. We going up, man. But to the next video, man. Authentic. I was about to say Authentic Frenchies. Until the next video, Authentic Benny. We out.